I often hear people say, ugh, history. I never liked history. When I ask them, why is that? What is it about history that you didn't like when you were in high school or college? What immediately comes to, to mind is the names and the dates. People think of it as kind of a timeline, a chronology uh, that they have to memorize. And what I tell all of my students is that history is not about, ultimately, the names and the dates, though they can be important. It's, it's about the story. It's about explaining the why. One of the things I really enjoy about teaching the Native American Science and Technology course is having the opportunity to do a deep dive into the Native American history before Europeans arrived. In this class, you're going to learn about how Native Americans built apartment buildings, temples, how Native Americans understood nature, astronomy, how they domesticated crops like corn, which was originally simply you know, a grass-like plant that you certainly wouldn't want to try to eat, but they transformed that into uh, the corn that we're familiar with today. An exciting new course offering in the History Department is History 1331, Science and Technology in American Society. This fulfills the general education requirement in American history. Since the beginning of human history, people have been studying the world around them to try to develop better ways of doing things that would improve their own lives, the lives of their families and communities. I think science and technology provide an ideal prism through which to view American history. Because in many ways, science and technology and the history of science and technology capture the essence of American history. We also look in this class at the history of medicine, which is, of course, deeply intertwined with that of the history of science. And we see how Americans face challenges like epidemics in the 19th century. On the one hand, it's a story of, of progress, expansion, triumph, but it's also a story of pain and setback and destruction. The history of science and technology is about more than just how societies have progressed. It provides us insights that we can use to understand our present and to confront our future. This is Professor Paul Conrad. Welcome to my class.